So an update, um, uh, yeah, it works, look, it works, I am over the moon, um, I put in the cooler master cooler for now, temporarily, I don't think when I stick it back into the 900D, I'll put the water cooling loop, because I, I think, because um, earlier on, you saw me put in both CPUs, and it came out with a B1, B1, I looked it up, B1 didn't make sense. The error code B1 I, is beyond me, uh, basically it's an error. And so I need to buy another Xeon 2670. So I'm going to be on eBay pretty soon in the market for 2670. Anyway, the fact that it actually boots and it's working and um, the screen and everything is kind of tickety-boo, I'm well pleased. Just well pleased. So yeah, it's all good. I'm just kind of monitoring the temperature at the moment. Um, 4 to 60 is quite high, but it's a warm and muggy day. Um, I think it's around 24 in the room. Um, so anyway, uh, yeah, well pleased. Um, everything's kind of temporary. I'm not going to stick it back in the in the case just yet. I may stick in a temporary um, uh, AMD 6300 in there. Just so I can have access to the um, the RAID config because I've got some files in there that I need. But other than that, um, I'm going to be testing this um, like crazy because I don't want to start putting the loop back in and all that kind of stuff in until I'm absolutely certain that um, everything's tickety boo. Um, so I mean, um, I just want to mention um, Asus. Asus have been incredible. Um, I I I went on some forums about this this um, particular motherboard, and every well not everyone but the the oh, there was an overwhelming consensus that Asus technical support were rubbish, and I would have to agree to to that their basic technical support was no help. They just said um, can't help you, um, go and email these guys. So I emailed these guys, and I'll put the um, info up on the screen. And um, they were fantastic. They just said, fill in the form. I filled in the form, and a couple of hours later, they said, right, yeah, that's good. Uh, we'll send you a replacement first. They did. And then I need to send the old one, which is in here. I need to send that back um, once they've um, told me um, some more details. But, yeah, it was it was so quick. Um, I emailed them yesterday, and the, and the server board arrived today. Maybe it's part of their server division that they kind of um you know um expedite things a little bit but yeah i was i was incredibly happy with the speed of that um what do i think well i'm thinking that because i could have just given it up i could have just abandoned everything i could have just let it go but um and i've done all the tests and that kind of stuff and clearly uh, the performance of this is not up to scratch it isn't it just is not up to scratch even with my aging um, 39, um, 30K, which is in my, my other room. Uh, however, um, it has been a technical challenge. It has been um, a, a voyage of discovery and how things work and uh, this that, and the other. You know, um, building the loop was tremendous fun. And yeah, um, I if you can afford it, don't do it. <laughs> but if you are an enthusiast and just want a bit of kind of kudos or, or just want a bit of extra knowledge or something just to just for the heck of it then yeah do it so a big thank you to asus um support uh, big thank you to um the guys in the in the czech republic czech republic i know right crazy a uh, big thank you to the uh, dhl man who delivered it with a big old smile this morning uh, maybe because it's sunny i don't know but yeah very happy so um, the next update will be when I get the second CPU in and then I'll be testing it again but as for as things stand it's gonna be pretty much on my desk like this for the foreseeable future 
and then uh, we'll kind of see, we'll keep testing and testing and testing, maybe run, you know, run a lot of um, CPU intensive apps, maybe run Cinebench over and over and over again, and, uh, and see where we get from that. But anyway, uh, that's it for now. Questions below, like if you like, if you like, please. And if you dislike, let me know why, and I'll speak to you in the next one. Uh, thanks for watching.